the the point is is that it's now become such a, 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 a you know ubiquitous and corrosive uh, impact on our society that I can't find it funny anymore. I mean, I just, I just, yeah. I don't, I, it's hard for me to have, a, I'm, a, I'm, I'm trying to be a funny astronaut, but I, I have a hard time having a sense of humor about that, that kind of thing. I feel like yeah. Buzz Aldrin, that when a guy came up and said that the moon landing was a hoax, he clocked him, he hit him with a right hook and knocked him on his butt. And that, that's kind of like what I want to do. You know, when I, when <laughs> I, say, when I get that, <laughs> when I, when I used to get that question about the moon landing being fake, Garrett, I think at first I had like your reaction to it, that, oh yes, it's unbelievable. It's hard to believe, but we actually do these things. But I tell you, I've changed a little bit. Uh, I was at I was at Alan Bean's um, internment at Alan Bean the Moonwalker, his internment at uh, Arlington, and uh, I was I was asked to be an honorary pole bearer for him by his wife. This was quite an honor. And next to me was was the it was it was uh, it, the guys next to me were were all the Apollo guys were on you know standing there next to me, including your friend Bill Andrews, that is your neighbor now, right, right, yeah. Garrett, and. Yeah. And uh, you know Charlie. Bill, Duke, everybody, do you there. know who Bill Anders is? Bill Anders. Everybody, do you know who Bill tell Anders us, is? Tell us, Bill. He took the yep. picture, man. He took, he the, took picture. the picture he took on Apollo Eight. Uh, he took that picture, and uh, yeah. No. But I remember standing there next to these guys, thinking that what they did—not only what they did, but what that whole team did by putting people on the moon—was a great. I mean, I think the greatest accomplishment ever, and we're not going to match that for a long time. And. Uh, to to you know, to say that it didn't happen or claim it didn't happen, I don't think I don't think it's funny anymore. I think it's disrespectful to the memory because we're losing these. They're older now, and we're losing the the guys that walked on the moon and all the men and women that made it possible. So, I I don't necessarily think that's a funny thing any longer. I think that it's it's somewhat disrespectful. Well, it's frustrating. Yeah. So yeah, I I'm with you, but it's 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 around. Yeah. People are still doing it. But the best argument I've heard against it, and I mean this in a thoughtful way, is one that I think Neil deGrasse Tyson uh, may have come up with, but definitely have heard him mention, is uh, the amount of paperwork. Like if you're going to fake the moon landing, the cost of producing all that yeah. paperwork, and I'm not joking, yeah. man, you, it's warehouses full of yeah. documents and drawings and calculations just to fake all that would be more than you could afford. Yeah, well, well, and, well, and, and, a, lot, and, and Bill, a lot harder than doing it. Crazy. They might have yeah, thought yeah, of that. Is. Let's try to fake yeah. this. It's too hard. Let's just go. Let's it's just easier. do it. <laughs> the, 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 so I'm working. I'm working now as a consultant for a TV show called uh, For All Mankind on, on Apple TV, and it's an alternate history oh, of go. the yeah. of the of the space race and all that. Yeah, yeah. Where the the Russians, the Soviets rather, had uh, beaten the U.S. And that was so the premise. Any, yeah. If you have any, if you have any arguments with its science, uh, Bill, you can take it directly up with Garrett. <laughs> yeah, I, I can try to go right to him. Before we start, Garrett was going to make a yeah. point. The, Garrett was going to make a point, thing, and I started. It's all right, right. It's all right. The no, great no, thing, it's good for you. Yeah, he, he appreciates the feedback. <laughs> Are you done, Mass? <laughs> yeah, go ahead. <laughs> so I'm the great thing you. about thank, thank you. The great thing about working on this production is that they actually do want to get as much of the science right as they can. And the story is always going to win. And I tell people who get mad at me if something is wrong, I'm like, you've all seen the Academy Awards, right? They don't give out an Oscar for orbital mechanics, right? You get an Oscar for direction, for writing, for yeah. acting. Yeah, I think there should be an Oscar for orbital mechanics. But but anyway, <laughs> they don't have one. So they so they do their best. And but but I kind of hoped, you know, and we were trying. We had a lot of scenes that we shot on on a soundstage in Hollywood of people walking on the moon. Okay, and I know where this is going. And and uh, and and I, I and I was I was, I was telling people, and it's, I hope that we and we did make a few errors. Okay, so if you look really carefully at the show, you see a few things that are wrong, and I'm proud of that because I'm like, you, you, I, I want to tell people, you see. Even in this day and age with all this computer visual effects and, and, and million dollar budgets for, for stunts and, and everything else we got, uh, you still can't fake a moon landing. You, you can't do it. I mean, you, you can't get it perfectly right. What What's wrong? What What can we look for? Is it a Starbucks cup in the foreground there, or something? No, we, we didn't do no Game of Thrones uh, um, screw ups like that. But but um, but we did. There are, there are things like, for example, um, if you, if you look closely, the, 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 we don't always get the, the regolith doesn't always come off in following a parabolic trajectory in, 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 a, uh, you know, in the absence of any, any atmospheric drag. The, the, if you look, like the, the, another thing is we don't really get the dust right. Like the suits are, and, and the rovers are all like 
sparkling clean like they just came off the showroom floor and they're not covered in all the regolith like they really would be so there are things like that the spacesuit spacesuit showroom floor the 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 spacesuit showroom floor yes yes yeah yeah so anyway so so you know it's hard it's really 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 even even with all the technology we have today in the 60s faking it would have been much harder than doing it 